any concern A mountain lion similar to the one in this video taken in Sun Valley has been seen recently roaming the hillsides of Burbank and, in one case, attacking a local dog. It actually punctured some areas of the dog. The dog was treated a vet. So these mountain lions are going after the larger animals. Animals such as these deer, which are their natural prey. The Verdugo Mountains that border Burbank are home to both of these animals, and it is at the base of these mountains where the city of Burbank established the Stow Canyon Nature Center to help inform and educate the public on everything nature, including the indigenous mountain lion. They're native to this region and to the Verdugo Mountains. Um, they used to have broad uh, animal corridors between the Santa Monica Hollywood Hills and the San Gabriel Mountains. Now with urbanization, it's made literally made the Verdugos in a, a wildlands island. So if you're thinking that these animals and their habitat aren't anywhere near you, well just turn around and you might realize that they're right next door. With the droughts that we've been having in the recent decades, um, the animals are coming down into the neighborhoods to get water, biggie, uh, because a lot of the springs have been buried under development. If you do find yourself face to face with a mountain lion, most importantly, do not run. Face the animal. If you have any small children with you, pick them up and make yourself look as big as possible and then follow this advice from our expert. So you stand your ground and you reach down and you find the one animal inside yourself that mountain lions are afraid of, and that's bears. Now, one thing that helps is throw up your arms or pull up your jacket behind you like a bear rising. Sometimes just that will make the animal step back. But generally, if he's decided to come towards you, you need to find your inner bear. You reach down and you bellow like a bear. So you go, Roar! That's a good suggestion for scaring away not only mountain lions, but also coyotes, which have become frequent visitors to our neighborhoods as well. To help keep you, your family, and pets safe, here are a few wild animal prevention tips. Do not leave children and pets unattended, especially when mountain lions are most active at dawn, dusk, and at night. Bring pet food inside to avoid attracting raccoons, possums, and other potential mountain lion prey. Do not hike, bike, or jog alone and install motion-sensitive lighting around the house. Follow these tips and hopefully you won't ever encounter four-legged neighbors like this. For Burbank On Demand, I'm Walter Lutz.